Hello, my name is Noel, hashtag Sasson, and uh, I like to explore the world. And one such place I just found uh, the other day is a place called Ixengard. It is uh, a Viking village in Denmark. You can find by following, following the Ravshar way almost all the way down to the ocean and uh, take to the left by the sign that says uh, dog walking is forest next to a parking lot and you will find a fantastic viking village made with wood and love a process that has been going on for several decades now and this place it's very uh, rustic charming and extremely cool Amongst other things, they have a long table with a throne. They have an open kitchen area. And uh, they have a king's uh, castle with a palisade wall made of uh, wooden logs. There is also this here very fancy pub. Yes, a pub with some humongous barrels and a fireplace. There is also a uh, forge. A fully functioning forge, which had a blacksmith at the time at the time I was there due to a Viking themed LARP event. Yes, uh, we had a fully stacked blacksmith with a smith inside making things out of metal by uh, heating up iron. There is also a uh, ritual circle made of uh, lovely carved wooden figures to celebrate or venerate whatever you want to call it the Norse god amongst other one amongst them is Thor and you have Odin the one eyed with his ravens the yeoman god serpent and Frey, uh, Freya and her uh, cats for some reason she was pulled by cats they have also raised a bridge that serves only one purpose to have uh, fights on it and I do mean the kind where you have line, f line battles where two armies charge each other because as far as I can see Denmark is kind of flat and sandy so um, the, riv the river I've seen so far isn't very impressive or runny at all that said if you choose to go straight forward instead of into the village, you will find a uh, road that takes you all the way down to the beach that is long, flat and very dangerous if you go swimming in the waves. But it's not far from the ocean. Uh, then again, the ocean beach in Denmark is uh, the length of the whole country more or less, so there's that. You just have to cross some sand dunes, and then you're right by the waves. Oh yeah, and as I mentioned, the king's castle and the palisade wall. Well, they even made a entrance guard tower that gives you a full front view of the village, uh, where you can see all almost all of the houses and the locations. The fact that they have managed to build this is kind of impressive because it seems like Denmark has a bit of a law against cutting down th trees. And for good reason, it's everything is made of sand, right? And if everything is made of sand and you remove the roots, it will uh, cause soil erosion. And that will be bad. Along the village, there is also a lot of uh, decorations, uh, carved uh, animal stuff put on display. And also, since this is made in good old Viking tradition, Vikings were not mm, known for their masonry skills, so everything is practically made out of carved wood. Uh, and uh, that is very easy to see based on uh, the footage you see in front of you. In fact, it is quite a bit like walking into uh, Valheim. 
you know, that uh, survival crafting game on Steam that is so popular these days. In fact, this place could serve as a really, really good inspiration video for what you should build next time in Valheim. Because most of these uh, buildings and locations can be, what do you call, oh yeah, can be replicated or at least somewhat uh, duplicated into Valheim. With some exceptions, however, it is about as Valheim as you can get, which um, is very interesting because Valheim is Viking themed after all. And what more Norse can you get than wooden longhouses and row houses and such made out of wood? So, if there's one f word that would, uh, if there's something that would really summon up this all experience is that uh, all the Norse gods lives on in tradition, in the nature, in the woods. And everywhere you go, there is an adventure to be found, if you just move outside your door. Now I just need to get a better gimbal to deal with this uh, horrible uh, camera shaking. Anyways, my name is Njol, I just sat on and see you around and like, follow and subscribe to me on social media. I have links to all my stuff down below. And grab a t-shirt while you're at it. It helps me to make more videos.